determined to finish this anyway uh yeah you've been wondering if this stuff was going to be able to work together all that stuff if you had the, the you ain't gonna need it you ain't gonna need it they gonna have whatever you need it's gonna be ready so what was next so they ended up completing their nuptials <laughs> They did the whole wedding ceremony and everything turned out amazing. She walked down the aisle. They did a cute little, it sounded like they stood there for a while going back and forth with them, them nuptials talking about their past and all they had to go through in order to get to this moment, but they made it. <laughs> Y'all gonna have that moment where you're like, we made it. <laughs> Especially at all those of you that have had to go back and forth with this person. But those of you that haven't, it's like the getting to in the nuptials to the getting to part <laughs> they're gonna be lit okay and once the ceremony is completed and the lord's bringing this to my attention somebody i was listening to recently was making this point of talking about the leap and it's gonna take a jump and this is a leap year and all i could think about was the old-fashioned jumping the broom You've jumped into this, okay? Some of y'all are jumping into this head first, okay? So, here's my final points on this word. Number one, somebody here, you get married to a football player. This wasn't a random word, okay? I said it before, I'm gonna say it again. Some of you, you here, you get married to a football player. Prophet Parham did a word called you're getting married to a football player or a person of status. Go look up that word. I probably got it in, in my uh, community post. Go look for it. So you're going to have to look in. It's attached to these two words in written form. Okay. You'll be able to find it. It probably isn't that far away if I didn't post these on the exact same day that I post these words. So uh, next to that. The Lord showed me something in a dream, and I'm going to try to keep my personal details out of it. Number one, you're going to be in a state of containment and contentment with your spouse. The Lord showed me keys to the kingdom, the word that you and your spouse are going to end up in a place, a room, a state where he's going to allot you the ability to rest. All I saw was my spouse was sleep. And I knew that this wasn't a specifically Genesis 2, 22, 23, 24, where he's pulling the rib out. No, 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 no. This isn't the pull the rib out moment. This is after the pull the rib. He's resting afterwards. Meaning he's in a rested state. Because his home is with you. And where you are is an encapsulation of the rest that he needs therefore david in the scripture where david reaches the promised land and he is brought and ushered into rest restful sleep my spouse was sleeping restfully at this point and i was sitting next to him and he he didn't look haggard he didn't look worn out he looked like he was in a peaceful sleep his hair was completely done perfectly everything he he wasn't a mess he was at peace but catch this i need you to catch this part you're going to be married you may not know how you may not see when you may not see how but you're already in alignment for your wedding okay you're in all of this alignment all right but your job is to clean out he's going to be sleeping but remember just like when your spouse you be presented to your spouse but god had to put him to sleep while he pulled that rib out your spouse is going to be asleep but you're going to have to pull some of them things i had to go to the refrigerator and start pulling the nasty stuff that was in the refrigerator out and separate that from the real good stuff I don't know whether I should share that. Mm. Lord Jesus. And the bell just started tolling. Oh, snap. 
I might share it at the end of this. Ooh, four, five, six. Shoot, something's about to happen. Anyway, um, yeah, it's your job to clean, separate, and remove the wheat from the tares. Your test is as these things come up, you're going to have to show your spouse what needs to be separated. That's going to be a testament for you guys. So that's the end of this word. I got another short thing I must include. I'm going to come back.